Hello Scorpio, welcome to another love reading. This one will be all about your person, the person you're thinking about or connecting with, and how your energies are between you, what's going on, and also where all of this is headed in the near future. Keep in mind that these readings are general, so they cannot and will not resonate with every Scorpio watching. So take what resonates for you, what applies to you. Not every Scorpio reading will resonate. All right, so for Scorpio, Spirits, Angels, Guides, what is the message for Scorpio? What are their person's thoughts, feelings, energies when it comes to Scorpio? I love you. That is a lot, but I'm just going to take them. I'm ready to commit. My heart belongs to you, and I wasn't ready. Okay. <laughs> so I feel like um like a mix of emotions here. Like your person obviously has feelings for you. But I also think they have a lot of regrets as well. Maybe they weren't ready for what you, I don't know, to give you what you deserved, maybe. My, I love you. My heart belongs to you. Wow. This person really cares about you, Scorpio. What else do we need to know for Scorpio? What else do we need to know? Thoughts, feelings, energies towards what do we need to know? Energy okay. Pure seduction, judgment, call, and hidden feelings. Something happened. I think they're trying to convince you of this. Maybe you don't know they feel like this, Scorpio. Maybe they're hiding their attraction for you. What do we need to know about this person that Scorpio is thinking about connecting with? What are their thoughts, energies, feelings towards Scorpio? The grass wasn't greener on the other side. Didn't you have a reading like this? I have never felt a bond as strong as ours. Well, recently, Scorpio, if this resonates for you, you might want to check out your playlist because there's someone that's been wanting to be with you again. They don't want your connection to end with them. This might be a continuation of that. We'll see. The grass wasn't greener on the other side. Yeah, I feel like this person is trying to make something up to you. Let me get some insight, please, for Scorpio. What is this person thinking, feeling? Comes to Scorpio to this connection. What are their thoughts, feelings, intentions towards Scorpio? We need to know. Thoughts, feelings, intentions. Comes to Scorpio. What do we need to know? This is how they're feeling, thinking about you. Page of Swords, Ace of Wands, Ten of Pentacles, Reverse. In their intentions, next actions, we have the Lovers, Reverse. Four of Cups, Five of Cups, Reverse. Yeah, this person is feeling regrets. Yeah, Three of Swords. This person, something happened between you and this person, and they are still keeping tabs on you. Still, I feel, pining after you. I don't know if you're in contact with them, but they are viewing you, observing you, and desiring a future with you, I feel, with this Ace of Wands. But the Lovers Reverse, Four of Cups, Five of Cups Reverse, they, there's a hurdle here, which is a separation or at least uh, emotional divide. The Ten of Pentacles Reverse, I feel like this person was not able to commit to you. They probably are not able to commit to you now. Maybe they, they're not very stable or secure right now. Why is the Ten of Pentacles Reverse? Why is the Ten of Pentacles reverse? For a small number of you, I'm getting this um, 
message this is not going to be for everyone i feel like this person knows you are recently single and they're thinking that this is going to be their their way in yeah page of cups this person's gonna they're they're remorseful they have regrets tell me about the ten of pentacles reverse tell me about the ten of pentacles reverse eight of swords yeah they're fearful of coming forward I think that they're afraid because they could get rejected. Tell me about the Page of Swords. Why is the Page of Swords here? Why is the Page of Swords here? The Hierophant. Taurus energy. Why is the Page of Swords here? There's something here about like commitment. Yeah, Seven of Wands. Hmm. Some of you, maybe this person knows that you're not, you were recently single. I still feel that. Others of you, I feel like this person wants to commit to you because they weren't able to commit before. But I think you would be, in their mind, I guess I should say, in their mind, you would be blocked or resistant against this. Like you're not interested in this with them. This is how they're thinking about it. Tell me about the Ace of Wands. And it could be because of the way things ended that you told this person that you were done. Wow, Eight of Cups. The Devil, Capricorn, Energy, and judge Judgment. I think this person wants a second chance after they walked away because the grass was a greener on the other side and they weren't able to find the connection that they had with you elsewhere. They th probably thought they would, but they didn't. And now I feel like they have to come to you with their tail between their legs. <laughs> um, and I guess this is going to be up to you, Scorpio. Tell me about the lovers reverse. Tell me about that. Maybe they ended up with a karmic with the devil there. Tell me about the lovers reverse Gemini energy here. Page of Wands. Okay. Three of Pentacles. Yeah, this is let's start over. Yeah, Ten of Swords. And then there's the High Priestess. You don't know that this person is thinking about your connection in this way. Let me move this over. I don't think you know that this person is thinking about you and your connection in this way. That they're thinking about rebuilding. Maybe you maybe you know as well. It's like the, they're holding on to you. Tell me about the Four of Cups. Tell me about the Four of Cups. Yeah. Eight of Pentacles. They're, they, I, I don't think... I think they're very motivated and willing to work hard. Eight of Pentacles, Knight of Wands. They're willing to do what it takes. But I don't think it's it's that easy. I don't know. Maybe some of you are completely done with this person. Others of you, I feel like it depends on the, the way that they come forward. Tell me about the Five of Cups reverse. The Emperor, Aries energy. Yeah. Five of Pentacles. They want to overcome the past. They want to overcome the loss, the struggle. Yeah, and be a pair again. Nine of Pentacles and the Lovers. This is very clear energy. What is this person's true intentions towards Scorpio? What are their true intentions towards Scorpio? What are their true intentions, Source Scorpio? Oh. The octopus is about entanglements, attachments. This person feels a very strong attachment. Yeah, I have never felt a bond as strong as ours. Pure seduction. There's a bond that they feel, and I don't think, I think also it's almost like self-inflicted, like 
they cannot sever this bond with you. It would be unthinkable. I even think that for some of you, this person left where they felt the grass was greener, but they never truly let you go. Be careful with this energy because this energy, they, it's almost like a, these attachments can become unhealthy. This person might even be a little bit obsessed with having a second chance with you. Um, I think this is all they think about with the Eight of Swords and the Page of Cups here, Four of Pentacles, Eight of Pentacles, Knight of Wands, you know, but I feel that there is a block on your side, almost like you're not really open to this, maybe because of what happened, maybe because of the way things ended. What else do we need to know about this person, this situation? What else do we need to know about this person, this situation for Scorpio? Marriage. What else do we need to know? Some of you could have been married to this person, but I honestly feel like this person wasn't able to commit to you before. So maybe this is what they're going to try to bring to you. Marriage with their divine feminine i do have false person at the bottom of the deck here hmm. tell me about the octopus why is the octopus energy here why is the octopus energy here Two of Swords. Hmm. Why is the Octopus energy here? Four of Swords, Knight of Cups. This person, yeah. They're not going to give up easily. I think that they're literally like stubbornly holding on to you. And they're going to probably come to you more than once. Temperance at the bottom of the deck. As many times as necessary as they feel is necessary to heal this. I don't think they've told you this, but I think it's because of pride. I, I don't think it's fear. I think this person made the wrong choice and it's gonna take begging possibly or to swallow their pride and admit they made the wrong choice. And I think in their mind, for a lot of you, this is a big thing for them to do. So I don't think failure is an option. I think if you were to reject them once, they're gonna come a few times until you like, if you really don't wanna be with them, you need to be very firm and tell them. But I think their persistence will convince some of you that they are serious about what they say. And maybe they're gonna be very um, sincere. Page of Cups, Knight of Cups, they tend to be very genuine, very sincere, and temperance is here. Yeah, and Four of Wands. They want harmony. They don't want to have any issues between you. They wanna have peace again, stability again. I feel like they had that with you, but maybe not where they went to. And maybe they learned being over there that what they had was very special and they effed up. <laughs> so that's what I have for you, Scorpio. I hope you enjoyed this bonus reading. If you did, hit that like button and subscribe uh, so you can see more readings from me. And I will see you all in another video very soon. Take care.